mobile division officers here in New Providence confiscated a quantity of suspected marijuana from a home on Market and Fowler Streets shortly after 5 o'clock yesterday afternoon. Police say no arrests were made in connection with the incident. An active police investigation continues. Over in Grand Bahama, drug enforcement unit officers there discovered a significant amount of dangerous drugs around 12.30 Friday morning. The officers, along with customs officers acting on information, randomly searched empty containers at the Freeport Container Port. The officers discovered 50 pounds of suspected cocaine worth $500,000. Additionally, Grand Bahama Drug Enforcement Unit and Mobile Division officers mounted Operation Lucky Fawcett between 4.30 a.m. and 1.10 p.m. this past Friday. Friday in the Freeport area that led to the arrest of eight Grand Bahama men between the ages of 21 and 43 years old. As a result, a quantity of suspected marijuana and cash was confiscated. Grand Bahama police are expected to arraign the men in the Freeport Magistrates Court at 10 o'clock on Monday morning. A United States Coast Guard crew rescued a man found clinging to his boat that capsized off Bimini Saturday morning. According to the Associated Press online, officials say a towboat crew reported hearing a distress where the caller told them he was in the water holding on to his capsized vessel and a handheld radio. The Coast Guard launched air and sea crews from Miami. The helicopter crew spotted the man Saturday morning and directed the Coast Guard vessel to his location 50 miles west of Bimini. The rescue man was taken to Miami for medical care. However, U.S. Coast Guard officials say the rescue is a great example of the importance of having the proper safety equipment on board your vessel and staying with your vessel if it capsizes.